Do you want to be the coolest ninja in class, the office wizard, or just have a fun skill to work on while you're bored at home? Then follow along with me in this video, and in only 5 minutes, I am going to teach you 3 super cool pen spinning tricks you can learn right now. But you gotta focus. Awesome, grab a pen or an unsharp pencil and let's get started learning number one, the thumb around. Now it's easy to grasp the concept of this move simply without a pen or a pencil at first. Just take your palm, supinate it, which means turn it towards the sky. Then what I want you to do is take your middle finger and your thumb and put the tips together. Now you can do a simple snap motion like you would be snapping your fingers at someone. The motion you are going to use to achieve the thumb around is very similar to that simple snap. The only difference is you may want to have your middle finger slightly more towards the side of your thumb as so. Now when you're ready, just like I'm doing in this example, you want to grab your pen or pencil and hold it towards the front third. This is so when it spins over your thumb, you'll be able to grab it rather than it flying off. Now with your pen in hand and your palm towards the sky, you want to do that same snapping motion with the middle finger towards the side of the thumb, allowing your pen to rotate over your thumb. Now a reason for this not going smoothly, if you're not doing this naturally already, pay attention, you may notice that my index finger points downwards as I do my snap. This allows for the pen to spin over my thumb and then clear its way back into my grip. So if you notice you're hitting your index finger when your pen's coming around, you want to consciously point your index finger down as you snap your middle finger up towards the side, allowing that clearance and that pen to come through. Work on this and go slow at first. It actually doesn't have to be too aggressive to get this pen to spin around, as long as you're holding it towards the front third of the pen. It feels super cool and looks super cool. The thumb around. Enjoy. I remember when I saw this one done by my friend Robin in 12th grade. It blew my mind, but I focused and learned it, and now I'm teaching it to you. Pay attention. Number two, the Sonic. Now take your pen or pencil and hold it in between the ring finger and the middle finger at about the middle of the pen or pencil. To understand the primary motion we want to achieve, you can simply take the bottom or top of your pen or pencil and rotate it in a circle as so. Now to understand the part that will blow people's mind, the pass, but can be easily achieved just by breaking it down. Now as you're doing that spinning motion by grabbing the top or bottom of the pencil, as the bottom of your pencil reaches towards the outside of your pinky, you want to duck the middle finger, allowing the bottom of the pencil to pass over the middle finger into the gap between the index finger and the middle finger. So you're going from between the middle finger and ring finger over to between the index finger and the middle finger, just as so. Now, in order to achieve this spinning momentum, we need to learn the simple flick. Place your pen or pencil back between your ring finger and middle finger. You want to then take the pen or pencil and place the bottom of it above the webbing between your thumb and index finger. From here, work on this simple flick that I'm showing, flicking it off of the webbing between the thumb and index finger. You want to use this flick to generate momentum into your spin. At first, you can work on just flicking the pen into the basic spin we showed in the first step to this move. Then, when ready, you want to fully attempt the pass. Flick the pen, and as the bottom of the pen reaches around to the side of the pinky, you want to duck the middle finger, allowing the pen to pass over the middle finger into the gap between the middle and index finger, as so. It is super trippy, but looks super cool. The Sonic. Finally, number three. There may be an official name for this, but I am calling it the Over the Top. You can start by taking your pen or pencil and holding it at about the center 
between your index finger and middle finger. Now the spin will be over the index finger and then grabbing it with your thumb and index finger. Now just like the Sonic, to generate momentum for this spin, we want to do the same flicking motion. However, unlike the Sonic, we want the pen to spin up and over the index finger straight. Just straight around the index finger, kind of like how the thumb around went straight around the thumb. Now it also helps to do a slight wrist twist as well after the flick to guide the spin. If you can't get the pen to spin properly at first, it can really help just to grab the pen in the proper position, do the wrist flick, and actually spin your pen like twirling a drumstick in the air, and then trying to grab it between the thumb and index finger, as shown. Now you can slowly tighten up this throw, bring it closer to that index finger more and more until it becomes the spin, the up and around, Congratulations, ooh, feels so good, looks so cool. Now you can combine these three spins together as shown for a super cool combo. You're a wizard, you're a ninja, you're not bored anymore. Let me know in the comments how learning these spins worked out for you. We are going to be learning a ton more skills quickly, so stay tuned, subscribe, and turn those notifications on. Thank you all so much for watching. Your positive support and feedback means a ton to me. I hope you all have a great day. Peace. I will see you all in the next video.